that I am a student. And this year, you know, in this year, 2022, as a student, it, <laughs> this year it was like those past months, they were very like. Uh, then I don't want to see the work there for Nigerians too, because we haven't experienced one of the longest strikes in the nation of Nigeria. And it was so determining on our lessons, our academics, and, and so on. What well, I want to remember in this 2022 is the good things that have happened there. 2022 is a year to be remembered. It's a year, a year full of war. As a matter of full of war, hunger and uh, stagnancy. No going forward, no, go, no going back. No left, no right. Everything is just stand still. Uh, youth are not even smiling. As in this year, it's minus. It's not, there's no plus in this year at all. Everybody's just struggling to live. That's just what I think. That's what I can say about 2022. But I hope the better years are ahead. 2022 is the most poorest year so far. Seriously speaking. This is it. couldn't be forgotten by any any work in Nigeria. Even outside the Nigeria and even inside this Nigeria as well. So this this con I mean this country as a whole. And this year, seriously. Before we enter into another year. Well, this year has gone already. We thank God for life. Many has gone, but thank God we are still alive. We should, we should just thank God that our life is still here. Because some has gone, searching for money here and there. But we should thank God for it now, sir. Good death, and uh, he's living his life in a mess through saving from God. It's enough to remember for. Not everything is money. There are so many things to, to thank God for. Some people are in the grave, some people are in the hospital, and some people are in prison. Yeah. But if someone is alive, if I thought the, the country's economy is so bad or so down, if someone is making a living, that's okay. It's, it's worth remembering it for. But the present year, no matter how we are, if somebody is still alive, you have hope for the further year coming up. Even the past may not be so that be, may be blissful. But the present one, we will thank God for, and that one will be hopeful to make a good, better way and better life for the upcoming year as well. That's the way to remember a, a year for. Not everything is money, and not everything is that. Even, they were even all over the world, everybody knows that the economy are not like before. But if somebody can survive and think for that, you will still make a better life out, out of the coming years. In 2023, we a lot of hope that you see. And then years before that time, it's been somehow a kind of. I, I was in a depressing state. You understand? But 2022 has catapulted me in such a way that I am very open for 2023. Very, very open. You understand? Now? That just that 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 what has been carrying me along for long. Uh, we thank God for life. But throughout this year, have been so. Let me say it have been so tough. So many things have been happening. People dying. COVID-19 came. Everything. Generally, this year to me is very hard and, and tough. But we thank God for life. We thank God we are still alive. So we believe that next year will be better for every one of us.